It's not a difficult question to ask. Um, I have a lot of Game Informers. Now, these are Game Informers that were when you uh, you subscribe to uh, being a member of GameStop, GameStop's nonsense. So this is all covering the last decade. Do you remember 2010s, the birth of Minecraft and all that? How well do you remember your last decade? How well do you remember the 20-teens, the 2010s? Um, I do have a couple of Game Informers from the 2000s era, late 90s. Uh, but I wanted to see if you all wanted to uh, have me cover these magazines. Now, for every like and every positive comment will equal one issue. Uh, there are topics that, you know, predictions and look back at things we forgot. I think there's an Ouya-like review and some Steam Machines. All this, okay, so all these different issues I have. Some of them are giant -ish, uh, giant magazines, okay? And some of them are just smaller to make it economy size. I always just, you know, when I so when I joined the membership to get, to actually buy things at GameStop, and I did this from 2002 to 2016, but I didn't get like Game Informer magazines until the last, like beginning of the last decade. So from 2002 to 2010, I didn't do shit. I didn't get anything, so... It wasn't until the beginning of last decade when I first moved into this house that I got these magazines and I got paper and not digital. So you'll have to tell me uh, or give me a like or give me a comment. And for each comment that says yay or and, and or each uh, thumbs up, I will review an issue. 